In this video, we're going to talk about how to do short division. So let's start with an example problem. Let's divide 1720 by 8. So how can we do this using short division? Let me space out the numbers. So the first thing you want to ask yourself is, how many times does 8 go into 17? 8 goes into 17 2 times. 8 times 2 is 16. And if you subtract 17 by 16, you'll get a difference of 1. Now, you need to write that 1 with the next number 2. And then you need to ask yourself, how many times does 8 go into 12? 8 goes into 12 1 time. 8 times 1 is 8, and the difference between 12 and 8 is 4. So that 4, you transfer it to the next number. So you have 40. So how many times does 8 go into 40? 8 goes into 40 5 times. And it's exactly 5 times. So this is your final answer. So therefore, 1720 divided by 8 is 215. And so that's the basic idea behind short division. Instead of writing all this stuff that will go here, you simply do a lot of it in your head, keeping track of a few numbers. And so this technique is not that bad. But for the sake of practice, let's work on a few more examples. So try this one. 3,123 divided by 9. So go ahead and use short division to get the answer. So how many times does 9 go into 31? 9 goes into 31 3 times. 9 times 3 is 27. 9 times 4 is 36, and that exceeds 31, so we don't want to use that. Our next step is to take the difference between 31 and 27. 31 minus 27 is 4, and so we need to transfer the 4 to the next number. Now, how many times does 9 go into 42? 9 times 4 is 36. 9 times 5 is 45, so 45 exceeds 42. So 9 goes into 42 4 times. And so 9 times 4 is 36, as we said. Now we need to take the difference between 42 and 36. 42 minus 36 is 6. And let's take that 6, transfer it to the next number. Now, how many times does 9 go into 63? 9 goes into 63 7 times. And it's exactly 7 times with no remainder. And so, 3,123 divided by 9 is equal to this answer, 347. And so that's another example of how to do short division. Now, let's work on another example for the sake of practice. Let's divide 2964 by 12. So how many times does 12 go into 29? 12 goes into 29 two times. 12 times 2 is 24. And 12 times 3 is 36, so that's too high. Now, we need to take the difference between 29 and 24. So the difference is 5. Now, how many times does 12 go into 56? Well, 12 times 4 is 48. 12 times 5 is 60. And so that's too high. Therefore, 12 goes into 56 four times. 12 times 4, as we mentioned before, is 48. And the difference between 56 and 48 is 8. So let's transfer the 8 to the next number. Now 12 goes exactly into 84 7 times. So the answer for this problem is 247. Now let's move on to our next example. Let's divide 3402 by 7. So how many times does 7 goes into 34? 7 goes into 34 4 times. 7 times 4 is 28. And 34 minus 28 is 6. So let's transfer the 6 to the next number. 7 
goes into 60 eight times. 7 times 8 is 56, and 60 minus 56 is 4. Now let's transfer the 4 to the next number. 7 goes into 42 exactly 6 times. And so this is the answer, 486.